All right then. Hello, we're back to part four of Escape the Backrooms, and we left off uh, basically covering every level in between level five to level six, which is where we're on now. It's a really dark level, as you can see. It'll become even darker soon. But yes, we are. We covered, I think, level from all the way from level five to the video to the to the other video to. Damn, a lot of supplies in here. What the heck? Well, I guess that's pretty good. The fact that there are so many supplies here, I'll basically never run out of sanity now, so thank you. Yep. A lot of stuff. Well, anyway. We covered, I think, level fun, level 37, level exclamation mark, level um, the end, level 992 whatever, and level... I think... Um, damn, the ambience is pretty goddamn creepy in this level. What the heck? The ambience is pretty... Pretty creepy in this level. And yeah, in level 94. So all of those levels, I think, except 94, are all, were all relatively short. So which is why we were able to get... Holy damn. Wow. A wretch. That was actually... This level's creepy as heck. Just the darkness consuming you. So it was one of the scariest in the game. I hope that wretch won't come here. I don't think he can come in this section, but I hope I'm wrong about that. Actually, no, I, I hope I'm not wrong about that because I, I am wrong. That means that he can come in here. Not seeing him. Not seeing him anywhere. I don't think he's here. Is he here? The ambience, though. This level's just so creepy, dude. Which way do I go? Oh my god. I think I'm gonna go, like, here, maybe. What's in here? Nothing much. So dark, I can't even see anything without my flashlight. Wow, that's crazy. That's insane, dude. That's freaking insane. Okay, nothing here, just another dead end. Uh, I just heard something. Unless that was part of the ambience. I already been here. Yep, it's a maze. Guess I need to go the other way then. Should probably be really careful because of the. I'm not sure. Again, I don't know if the wretch can come to this section of the level, but gotta be still careful because if he does, I'm kind of screwed. I'm not seeing anything. All right. What the heck, dude? I think I I got my way out of the loop. Yeah, I did. All right. Not sure. Nothing. Nothing's there. Oh no! I didn't get myself out of the loop. I went all the way back to the start. <laughs> Not only did I not get my way back out of the loop, I literally just went back to the start. Seriously, where do I go, dude? 
What? I'm just so confused right now. I think I heard something. Okay, I think I finally got my way out of the loop. What the heck? Why do I have another flashlight? I don't need two flashlights. I don't know why the heck I have another flashlight, but yeah. I do for some reason, I don't know why. Yeah, that's just the dead end, I think. I think that's just the dead end. This part is really cool, like the lights. Is this a dead end? It's also a dead end. I'm gonna just backtrack real quick. Why is it red now? I'm gonna try to go here. Why is it red? <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah, I think there's just a dead end, 100%. I'm so lost. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to go here. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go there. This level is just making me just in a big maze. Just a giant maze. That's all level 6 really is. Although I really like this part in particular. Oh, shit. I'm hearing the wretch, dude. Still go here, yep. Yeah. 
Hell no, man. What the heck? That was a. P <laughs> he was literally standing right on top of me. Well then, I think that um, I just got really lucky. No, actually, I think you can just crouch to avoid him in this level. In this level, the wretch is not a huge problem because, as you can see, I literally was just crouched down. And another dead end. Yep. <laughs> God dang it, dude. Another dead end. Nice. Easy. Not good. Okay, let's just go here, I guess. That's just the wall. I want to like mark this path, huh? Yeah. This yet another dead end, dude. Are you kidding me? What the heck, dude? What the heck? Get another dead end. Nice. I think we're making pretty good progress. Yep, we definitely found a new route. That's good. Oh, and we found it. Let's go. Alright, we found it. Easy. <laughs> nice, dude. We did level 6. We, we conquered the maze. Moving on to level 7. This is kind of pointless towards us now, so you, let's just drop this, because I don't think we're going to need this again. Yeah. Pretty useless towards us now, because I don't think we can use this again. And we're back at the hub. Let's go. I don't know why we can't access some levels. I didn't find the hub door for level 37. I found it for 94 though. Yeah, let's just go back to level 7. Level 7. Alright. Alright then. That's just back to level 6, we don't want to go there. Damn, this water is filled with a bunch of crap, dude. This water is not good. This water ain't good, bro. This water ain't good, dude. Alright, so let's just take the boat, I guess, to the, to the house. Do we need anything? Wait, let me just see. Do we need any supplies? Nope, we're completely filled up. Well... Let's just go straight towards the lighthouse then. I know it's a bit of a speed run, speed run of the game, but 
If I don't need anything from the other houses, what's the point of going in them? It's just a waste of time. Level 7 also isn't particularly the most interesting level in the world, so there is that. It's just an infinite ocean. So it isn't exactly, like, particularly interesting, you know, just rowing the boat in the ocean. There's the lighthouse right there. So yeah, we need to progress towards that. I try to check my inventory. You can't when you're on the boat. I guess that does make sense. Because how would you be able to check your backpack at the same time as you're rowing a boat? I could go in there, but I don't think there's anything in these houses yet. Just a bunch of supplies. And I already am stacked to the brim with supplies from level 6. So, yeah. Just chilling on my boat. The fog, I think, it starts to set in now. Yep. Foggy and misty, although I can still see the house. God damn. I don't know why the thick fog just... Yeah, I see it. I see it. Don't worry. Again, I really don't need any supplies, so I would have gone to the houses, but it's also just boring, to be honest. I don't- this level's, I guess, like, kind of okay, but I- I don't know. It's just fine. There's no danger present here as well. There are no, like, harsh, hostile entities, I think, here, so... Yeah. Is this the house? Oh, no. Guys, I don't think that's the house. Nope. I kinda got lost. How did I get lost, dude? What the heck? Bro, how did I get lost again? What the heck? Okay, there's another house. So where's the lighthouse? I can't see anything. What is going on? Is that it? No, dude. What's going on? Okay, there it is. Okay, good. I almost got lost for a second, but yep, alright, it started. There. Okay. Thank you, Lighthouse. I appreciate it. Thank you. I really much appreciate your service, so thank you. Alright, now it's not foggy anymore once we reach the Lighthouse. Which doesn't make any sense, but okay. But okay, dude. They're all- I think that's the house I spawned in, all the way over there. Energy bar, energy bar. I might as well eat something, right? Yeah, sure. Why the heck not? Mmm, yummy. Energy bar. I only have juice? I have no almond water? What? This is the first time I have like only snacks and I have so much juice. I have so much juice. <laughs> what is this bro? What the heck? Okay, um, yeah, I need to actually eat something again. Well, alright, I need to eat a snack bar. Alright, pick this up real quick. Pick this shit up. Alright. Now we're going down. We are going down towards the deep depths of the ocean. Yep. Hello. Oh my god, this is so dark, dude. 
The ocean floor looks cool. I swear I'm like playing Subnautica right now. It feels like I'm playing Subnautica, dude. Look at the ocean generate. Look at the terrain, like just generating as I go in, by the way. Looks kind of cool, buddy. Look at this shit. What is this, by the way? What is this? What is this? Just a giant rock. Can I, like, swim up to the surface? Eh, probably wasting way too much time doing that. So, yeah, let's not. Damn. <laughs> it just generates as I move. That is really goddamn funny. It's insanely funny. The graphics look insane underwater, though. Like, the way they... It looks like a kelp forest from Subnautica with some weird... Weird-ass rock formations, though. That's what it looks like. It honestly looks like a combination of, like, the crag field and the kelp forest at the same time. I don't know how, but he... <sighs> Is that the entrance to the void? I need to find the entrance. Maybe is this it? Yeah, I think that's it. Well, anyway, yeah. The ocean looks pretty nice, but we have to move on. The ocean looks pretty cool, but yeah, I think we have to move on. We have to move on, so... Let's just go. No more wasting time, guys. Let's just proceed. Level 7, unfortunately, isn't the most interesting level in terms of gameplay. It looks pretty cool, though. Bro, what is happening? I'm stuck? Why am I getting stuck in the cave? Okay, there we go. I don't know why I was like getting lost and stuck in the game. Okay. Alright, level 8. Level flipping 8, dude. Level 8. That's, I guess, back to the entrance to level 7, but we obviously can't go there. There's nothing here. There's a bunch of supplies here. Put in some almond water, which I'll gladly take because I will need almond water. So now, yeah, level 8 is obviously a cave system. So let's explore this cave system, shall we? And be wary for, yep. Yep. <laughs> Female death mouse, once again, they drove me completely insane in the last level, in level, um, uh, well, whatchamacallit, it? level 5 in the boiler room. Level 5 was one of the best levels in the game, despite my a bit like frustration, I should say, with it. But level 5 was a really good level, still. It's a really damn good level. What's here, by the way? It looks pretty cool. Yeah, so just keep crouched in this area, basically. You don't have to, like, always keep crouched, but yeah. If you see a female death mob, like, really near you, obviously crouch, because he... Um, what's going on, dude? I know basically exactly where to go, so just follow my path, guys. Because this is a very confusing level, so... I understand, you know, if you can't seem to... I I was lost in here for the longest time, but you just need to basically hug one side of the wall. Until you can, um, uh... Basically just get to the other side. Just basically always hug, like, I guess the left, the left wall. Yeah, 
Except maybe I'm wrong. Where does this lead? I don't know, man. I'm just gonna keep. Bro, what the? I can't move, dude. What is happening? Okay, that problem was solved. I couldn't move for whatever reason. Some water here. What's happening here? Nothing much. It's just some. It's just some. It's just a puddle of water in this cave. This cave looks really cool, by the way. But yeah. It's very dangerous, as you can see, because there are a bunch of female death muffs. We have to crouch, obviously, while crossing the bridge, because it's very unstable. Do not try to run on it, by the way. It won't end well. But yeah. What? What? No way. Okay. No, but I lost everything. Oh. <laughs> wow. That's surprising. I didn't expect that. I mean, I'm not mad or anything. I don't care, honestly. But how? I guess I stayed too long on it, yeah. I was talking about the beautiful graphics. Yeah, don't get distracted by this game, guys. Okay, there we go. Just walk across, and then you're safe afterwards. As I said, yeah, the graphics... Okay, anyway, we got supplies anyway, so yeah. Flashlight, juice, almond water. Okay, nice. So the next section of the cave system yeah the next section is a bit dumb so I'm, I'm gonna basically show you how to get past the next section because the next section is actually very 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 dumb so the next section has skin stealers where you can't hide yes it's as dumb it's as dumb as it sounds guys but So basically go to the right side as skin stealers can't really initially spawn here though they can of course progress here so then you see as you can see a skin stealer is there you want to basically maneuver around them Yeah, as I said, the section is dumb. Very dumb. <laughs> yeah. So, I died one time. <laughs> so what you want to do is don't be like me and don't hesitate. Just I'm going to show you one more time. You just want to run as quickly as possible to the right side. Like, sprint. I'm going to show you now the proper way to do it unless I keep on dying on it. Because the section, as you can see, is very dumb. It's incredibly frustrating and just annoying incredibly so it's genuinely dumb let's just go here what great he spawned there <laughs> okay man okay how did he spawn there how? That's actually interesting. How did he spawn there? That's actually very interesting. I didn't know that they could spawn on the right side. Well, apparently, he moved that fast. He's just Usain Bolt speed. Be like Usain Bolt. Okay, so just basically with this action, don't get unlucky. Yes, that's the level. That's the level design, guys. That that's what it's come to. Just print and get lucky. So not very good level design. This is why my this level is not. I'm not a huge fan of this level, but ye. Yep, and because I encountered no skin stealer that time, it was really easy. All I had to do was sprint there, and yeah, that's it. Alright. 
So that's all you have to do to cross that section. Is simply sprint down the right side and get lucky. Yep, that's it. Just sprint down the right side until the door and get lucky. Hope you don't encounter skin stealers. That's what the level design has indeed come to. Is sprinting down that section. And we obviously cannot cross there because... Well, there's nothing to cross, so I think we must go here. Yes, we must go here. And we're back in level 0. Yep, we went all the way from level 8 to level 0. <laughs> we went from level 6 to level 7 to level 8, but now we're back to level 0. But it isn't the ordinary level 0, as I will show you. Yep, it is actually the Manila Room. Which is pretty damn cool. Which is pretty damn cool. Okay, I don't know. I kind of forgot this puzzle, guys. I'm sorry. I forgot the puzzle. I literally forgot. Literally forgot. Okay, I think we need like a code or something. Yeah, I think we need a code. All oh, right, we need to match the shapes of the numbers. So this should tell us what it is, I think. This should tell us what it is. Come on, man. So two is circle. Two is circle. Okay. Something circled something. Something circle arrow. So circle arrow. Square circle arrow. Okay, square circle arrow. Square circle arrow. I need to remember because ye, I don't know why. Short-term memory loss. I'm just joking. Square. Circle, arrow. Easy, okay. Nice, bro. And then we get this chainsaw. Yes, we have access to chainsaws now. But don't think that you can actually kill entities with this, because you can't. There's nothing else to this section of the level, by the way. It's literally just level zero, so yeah. Let's just get straight into this. Chop this side down. Yep, alright, easy. Easy, now we're in a- Bro, what? Oh, that's just a cutscene. I thought I died. No, it's just a cutscene. And now we are in level 0 0.11, aka water damage. This is basically just a sub-level of level 0, where everything is like covered in mold or in water. And just everything just looks like, you know, rotten. Yeah, this level is really- sub-level is really disgusting, but cool at the same time. So, yeah. Okay. Bruh. Bruh. This is of course on yet another maze, so great, just just great. It's yet another maze, guys. To get another maze type area, which you don't you don't love to see that you you don't love to see that. Okay, I think we have to go there. Though. Yeah, we definitely have to go there. This flickering light basically will point us in the right direction, I suppose. And nope, apparently I was wrong. Yeah, as you can see, my knowledge, my, how good I am of mazes is really bad. I mean, like, really bad. Okay, never mind. I found the arrow. Okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool moment. Oh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. What? Where did I just end up? No, I'm going the right way. Why is this level- This level is straight up confusing me. Level 0 0.11, why are you confusing? You are confusing me. You are 
confusing me. Come on. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. So far, there have been, like, no levels, like, level 1, like, level 5 length. Meaning, just ridiculously long. Which, honestly, I kind of don't like because these levels feel like they're a bitch too short. I love these levels. Okay. So, we reached the second section of the level. Pull all the levers and run through the gate so it can't follow you. And it is actually the holder. Yep, the holder returns for round 2, except round 1 didn't even exist. Well, because... Because ye. So where's the holder? Ah, here. Okay. Alright, so no, no levers here. Not good. Okay, so... No, dude, why am I stuck all the time? What kind of piece of garbage is this? And I can't even grab that juice because of trash. Yay, hooray. Anyway, th this lever runs on a timer, so I can't just afford to waste time. Can't afford to waste time like this. Okay. Where is it? Which piece of shit? Piece of freaking shit, dude. Why am I always stuck? Like, what was I stuck on? Just don't understand, dude. What the heck am I stuck on? What the heck am I stuck on, dude? For real, man? Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay, then. Alright, holder. We can, we can chill, right? We can chill. Can chill. Okay. Okay then. <sighs> All right. Put breaking doors with chainsaws, pulling levers. Yep, that's the gameplay loop of level zero point eleven. I actually really like it. To be honest, it seems like fun. Seems pretty fun to me. Can't pick this up, okay. Can't pick this shit up, okay, nice. Alright, we can't go there, obviously. I'm a bit slow, so I may not be able to. No, I think I should be able to, as long as I'm, like, wary of the hole, right? Okay, it's not here. It's not here anywhere. Fuck! Frick, 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 no, 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 Okay, over there. Yeah, just keep on walking, keep on walking. Keep on walking, keep on walking. Keep on walking, dude. Just, yeah, just keep on walking, dude. Yeah, just keep on, yeah, turn, turn that other way, turn that other way. Dude, turn. Dude, come on, man. Please, turn, turn. You see there? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Might come out that way, yeah. Probably not the best idea.
No! Hell no, hell no. Bro! Oh my god, dude. Jesus, man. Thank god, dude. Okay, whoo wee. Not okay, man. Not okay. Not okay, man. Not okay. Okay, good. Holy shit, where the heck did he go? Where the heck did he go? Where the heck did he go? I don't know. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on. What? Get in there! Get in there! Close the door. God damn it, the time ended on those other two. Okay, I need to be fast as fuck, boy. Be fast as fuck, boy. Fast as fuck. Fast as fuck. Okay, get that juice and run. Get that juice and freaking run. Okay. Need the other one, which I think is there. Which I think is there, dude. Where the heck is it? Fuck is it? It's not here. Okay, I need to just run. God damn it, it's not here. Come on, man. No, 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 no. Well, come on, man, dude. Come on, man. I'm so close. I just need this asshole to stop chasing me. I just need this asshole to stop bothering me for one second. Okay, he's over there. Where's he gonna go to? Where's he gonna go to? Just chill. Okay, just turn that other way, dude. Just turn that other way. I just need you to chill right now. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Go, go, go. Go that other way. Go, go. I need her to be like super fucking fast here. Fast as fuck, boy. I need to be fast as fuck, boy. Okay, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Fast, fast. Okay, nice, nice. Just need one more. I know where that exact one other is. Grab juice and you need to like sprint for it. Sprint for that shit before he manages to catch me. Sprint for that shit. Okay, drink this juice. Drink this juice. Drink this juice. And you just like run for it. Fucking run. Run, 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 run. Come on. Yes, please. Run for it. Yes, dude. Let's go. We did it. First try, dude. Easy. Level 188, except this is not level 188 at all. This is the small version, which is basically not a level. It's basically just... Yeah, it's really just not a level. So wait, what do we need to do if I forgot? Yeah, we need to like look at this. Look at the ones that are light up, I think. The windows, which are lit up. 4, 1, 5. 4, 1, 5, 3, 1, 4. 415314 4, 1, 5, 3, 1, 4. Okay, easy. Easy. <laughs> I am mad tired, so. But anyway. I just want to get to level 9, which I think. Yeah, we're at the level 8. The other side of level 8. As you can see, we were there, we needed to get through level 0 0.11 to get to the other side. And now we are at the other side of level 8. So yeah, alright, and now we're at level 9, right? Yep, we are indeed at level 9. And this is where we are ending this video, because trust me, level 9 is insanely long and will take a very long time. It's one of my, it's one of, if not my favorite levels in the game. Just look at this, look at the beautiful and wonderful atmosphere of this level. It's just truly gorgeous. But anyway, goodbye, guys, and I'll see you in the next Escape the Backrooms video coming probably tomorrow or I guess depending on which day I upload it. Probably tomorrow. Though. Anyway, bye, guys. Thank you. And peace.